Hey guys, guys, one one here, and welcome back to the what I think is the first ever kaiju fan or fan animation review, excuse me, of uh, 2024. Welcome, welcome to the free, yeah, first ever episode of uh, fan animation review of 2024. Wow, it, it, it two months I, it, into the new year, and I haven't done one of these yet. Crazy. Uh, first off, if you're wondering why I'm speaking so low or I'm not screaming at my usual volume. Uh, that's because it's late as hell as, as night. It, it's late as hell at night right now. That's why I, I can't fucking speak. Uh, you know, I had to catch up on college work. That's why I wasn't able to upload. But don't worry, I have I have some plans. You know, I, I was, you know, creatively bankrupt before. But now I actually know what <laughs> actually have some stuff to upload. Um, I got some fan animation reviews in the works. Uh. I have a read through, so we're going to be doing some, some of those. I have a new gaming series on the way. Check, look out for that. So yeah, no, I definitely got some stuff planned for y'all. the The drought is not gonna keep a. The drought's not gonna be here for a while. I promise, promise. It's a, uh, it's it's finna go away. But um, yeah, fan animation review time. Uh, today we're reviewing Godzilla minus one versus Shin Godzilla, and this was uploaded by the lovely Pivot Pivot Master. I think that's how you say their name. Well, I've definitely done a reaction to one of theirs. I'm pretty sure. I think it was Doom Slayer versus Godzilla. Like this was way way back when I still did reaction videos. I'm pretty sure I reacted to that video but i don't know i can't be sure it was a while ago but yeah no nah, and first off animation is fantastic uh, a little stiff but hey that's not at all a knock on knock on the animator or animation at all it really is i i like the stiffness of it. it it gives them more weight i'll say you know they actually feel like they're heavy and you know it takes them a while to move it reminds me of 2014 you know back when the monsters had like a in like a super realistic sense of scale the sense of scale isn't gone now uh, before any gxk fans come out of the woodworks and fucking attack me for even daring to criticize anything about the current monsterverse i, I like current monsterverse's uh, sense of scale it's fine but the earlier monsterverse sense of scale is just definitely superior i'd say but hey that's just you know my opinion you don't have to take it seriously at all really but um yeah, no, I like that they they move with a sense of uh, weight to them, like they're not running at each other. Well, minus one runs at uh, Shin Godzilla, but I'm more inclined to let minus one pass since minus one is small compared to Shin Godzilla. And as you can see on screen, they do, or yeah, Pivot Master, they do in fact keep the uh, size difference accurate. So they didn't scale him up like I did when he fought uh, GMK Godzilla. So yeah, no, he's definitely the size of like a, a fucking ping pong ball compared to the bowling ball that is shin godzilla but hey don't let that fool you minus one puts up a fight minus one puts up a good ass fight at first okay so the the plots first off minus one starts off destroying the city it doesn't get too far into it because shin godzilla appears minus one then runs at shin godzilla shin godzilla then bites down on minus one's head and then throws him across the bill throws him to buildings uh, then minus one gets up, and starts ragdolling Shin Godzilla, which I I don't think is possible because it, it Shin Godzilla definitely weighs too much for minus one to like pick up and grab and all that stuff, right? I'm pretty sure Shin Godzilla isn't weightless, right? Or or I don't know Shin Godzilla's like bi biology is strange. I, I haven't I have to like rewatch the movie and do my research on that, but I'm pretty sure Shin Godzilla isn't massless he, he uh, minus one should not be able to pick shin godzilla up like he did but hey this is clearly just animation made for fun i'm not gonna like you know get all super power scaly on it like a fucking nerd but um yeah notch uh minus one starts beating up on shin godzilla then shin godzilla does the classic you know hot ass black breath then the fire then the atomic breath classic scene iconic ass scene uh blows away minus one and then just uh, like usual it doesn't do that much damage to minus one it just like cuts a bit it like burns off a piece of his flesh which he easily regenerates then minus one charges up his atomic breath and he kills shin godzilla that's literally how it ends minus one basically shin one shots shin godzilla and it, it's accurate as hell too because minus one's atomic breath is powerful as shit and severely underrated but i'm glad some people are starting to pick up on that because I'm starting to see in a lot of versus battles videos and um, animations that I'm watching on YouTube, minus one is one shining the hell out of all these Godzilla's. But um, yeah, no, that's it really. The, 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 there isn't really a soundtrack. It's just like the kaiju fighting each other. Uh, the little music that is in there, like the outro and intro music, are great. Ten out of ten. <laughs> And uh, yeah, it's just this. It's not long. It's like four minutes. Watch the animation, please. It's a nice little 
you know, thing to pass by time. And, uh, you know, if you want to watch something for fun, not super into power scaling, all that, just watch it for yourself. You know, it's a fun little Godzilla fight. You know, I I know the director stated that he wanted to see for minus one or minus one sequel. I was about to say minus one, two. <laughs> Made no sense. Uh, for the minus one sequel, he wants to see Godzilla fights another monster. I hope they bring back Angiris. I really do hope they bring back Angiris, bro. Because Ang Angiris is like my second favorite kaiju. For those who don't know, I, I love Bro Gears. Bro Gears number two. I love you so much. I I wish they I hope they bring him back. Raids of Raids Again remake. Come on. Mr. Yamazaki, I believe that's your name. I I'm not I'm not really all that big for remakes. I think they pointless and kind of suck, but Hey man, if it's done right, it's done right, and I believe in Mr. Yamazaki that he can do it right. So I I hope that's your name, director. Oh, God, I t I'm horrible at names. Sorry, man. But if that is your name, I hope I, I hope I'm saying your name right. I have faith that you can do a Godzilla Rays again remake right, and I really hope that's the case. But I really hope minus one sequel does that brings back in gears. But hey, we're getting into stuff that's probably not gonna come out for a while now. So uh. Yeah, short little video for you guys today or tonight, whenever you're watching this. I'm going to go to sleep because I have school in the morning or the, and just stuff to do in general in the morning. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it today's video. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. And uh, yeah, until next time, we'll see you all in the next video. Peace.